That'll work. That'll be fine. That'll work. Stardew Valley across the universe. Rabbit farm. Ugh, boring. Come on. Your cut. Come on, you came up with the horse name. Saddle. What do we name the horse? Name it Saddle. Fucking really? You're naming a town Rabbit Farm? Come on. You're banned from the name game. Nah, you're banned. No name game for you. You wanted to call it Wedge Rass because it starred you backwards. It would be lucky if I let you name a chicken. And they're expendable, because I'd rather have dinosaurs or rabbits. You tell the young lad to go get saddled, and they fail. They fail at it, so you get... What? What the fuck is wrong with you? Shall we call them... Call the chicken wedges? You want to call the chicken wedges? Well, we'll figure it out. But we are going to start. Didn't they whip people back then? No, it's not a back then thing. There's slimes and all sorts of stuff, but there's cars. It's current day. It's supposed to be like a little village in the current day, but current day fantasy. So there's slimes and undead and fucking whatever else. Started in Wardest Farm. What? What the fuck are you talking about? Are you just swapping the letters around? You're a fuckhead. Banned. Banned from naming. Does anybody else have any name ideas? Please. <laughs> Rabbit ear farm? Tall farm? Tail farm. And you can hear the game well enough. Game menus and things. Oh, we've got a new. We've got options. And options can be here. You're a farm. <sighs> okay, well, as long as I can sit here and just chill out. I chill out with you guys tonight. We're gonna play a farm game. It's gonna be wonderful. But first, we have to name ourselves. There's so many different colors that you could be. And they're not in order at all. Which doesn't help. That's just sideways. Alright. Order a farm. House farm. You're a farm. You know what? You throw enough stuff at the wall, something will eventually stick. I do like you're a farm. I think I might name the farm you're a farm. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even it's not even your farm it's your farm <laughs> you are farm so dumb because it doesn't take that apostrophe. The apostrophe doesn't work. 
<laughs> you re-farm. Yeah, but it's lower, so it's your... But I can't put it together. Because then it's not a compound word. We could, sp we could spell it wrong, just to troll further. So it's your a farm. <laughs> just your, as in like your ownership. Your table. It's not you are table, it's your table. But this is ownership, it's your I, a farm. <laughs> your a farm. Is, that the, is the name of the farm A? Your a farm. I would like a sea farm. Uh, anybody that watches it any later than this isn't going to get that and think that we're fucking idiots and be like, oh, you can't, you can't spell. You can't spell you're a farm. It's supposed to be you are. You are a farm. That's your a farm. Favorite thing. Uh... I know a favourite thing. It hurts just... It hurts to just look at that. Triggered. Grammar. Yeah. Favourite thing, grammar. Yeah. Spell it with one M and two R's. Grandma, because we don't give a fuck about spelling. myself after what's a word that they use a lot of in Stardew Valley is this what it is no I am going to... I could name myself after one of the characters. I want something that is said a lot so that whenever they say the word I can be like, me? We have to take care of the town. We've got to put the town first. I think that the town is really going to have a good weekend this weekend. Yeah, we are. Do they call it the town or the village? If they call it the village, I'm fucked. Just look up, someone look up quotes.
let's shift some of these around. What have we got? Eye colour. Let's go... It's very dark or very dark. Oh, shit. No, not that. Let's go with, like, here-ish, I guess? No? Here. Perfect. Hair colour. Let's make it... I need to change the actual hair. The pants. Make the pants black. They don't need to be all the way, come on. Seventy-five. Get out of here. You're an insane person. Grandpa, friendship rating. Protagonist. Hello, protagonist. <laughs> I really like that. Oh, that's better. that's probably better than the town. Protagonist. Oh yeah. Hey, protagonist. <laughs> so gay. Hey, yourself. protagonist instead of the town. I reckon we need to jazz up these two. I think these two are fine for a joke once, but we need something cooler. Favourite thing, antagonist. Um, well, protagonists in all games thrive on chaos. Or like... Antagonizing? Nah. Only stuff can make me happy. <laughs> hey, Hashra. How you doing? <laughs> I gotta change a lot, but we're just figuring out the name of the farm. That was a little easter egg because that's how my hair really was in real life. I don't know with hair. I don't want to 
feeling. Looking for a bit, that's all good. Came in because you saw my tweet. <laughs> Oh, I appreciate you coming to hang out, dude. What shirt do we want? We're we'll stuck with it for a while. Ah, fuck. Well, whatever. Yeah, the rent is pretty good. trying to create a lost Final Fantasy character if you couldn't figure that out. Just like you know how they hear about Superman landing in some random rural town. It's like that. It's like a Final Fantasy character started their journey just working on a farm. You hear about them how they like they start the, the Final Fantasy adventure and they're like yeah it was like do you know how you use a weapon? It's like oh well I worked on my grandpa's old farm for four years. And they're like, excellent. And then this fucking super awesome hero comes out. They just hand him a shitty sword. And they're like, yep, you're the best. Because they, you know, worked on their granddad's farm for a bit. That's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm, I'm on the farm. <laughs> we're, we're the part before they were the exciting hero. You're on the Yora farm. Yeah, I'm going to change that too. I need to find a better shirt. That. Four buttons, so number 99. It's up there. If we had a top five, it'd be in it. Back to the first ones again. What's this one? <laughs> the Yora Farm. I've got an A on my shirt. Yeah, I work over on A farm. Your A farm. No, it's not. It's not your A farm. It's a. It's a French name. It's your A. A farm. Your A farm. Not your A farm. <laughs> that's fucking beautiful. I love it. All right, that's the backstory for the name. Yeah, it's A farm. Your A farm. Mate, I'm going to sell this shit. It's going to be amazing. Where's my eyes? Give me my eyes back. I know you're somewhere. Fuck. 
perfect. Hair colour needs to be a little louder, not too loud. There we go. No, we're not going to skip the intro. But what we are going to do, we are going to be playing on Four Corners Farm. Now, I do not know if this is part of these accents on letters. Yeah. Maybe accents on letters will work. Would it need to be on the R or the A? It has to be the A, or like the U or something. I don't know. Nothing's coming through. What if we can do a capital A with an accent? Is that possible? Yes, it is. Why don't you change for me? Boom, done. Yeah, there we go. It's A farm. Your A farm. That's perfect. I love it. Do we have glasses? Accessories. What do we got for accessories? No, no, no. Come on. Oh god. So it's accessory one. Beard, moustache, other moustaches, various moustaches, earrings, glasses that just cover my eyes, different glasses, a headband? Oh, mate. What was it? 13. that is and a duck spell. Yeah, it was really just a headband, wasn't it? That ain't. Yep. The only contender. Alright. Ah. I have a little bit of colour on the pants. No, you don't. I think that's everything. Am I missing anything? Do I look complete? Protagonist, your farm, favorite thing, stuff. You know what? We're gonna go even better than stuff then. There we go. When I now think of. Vengeance! It is where I derive my power. Well, yeah, I've got a, I've got a general rule. I've got, here's a general rule, Hashra. I will play either, depending on... on what's going on. But usually... Usually... I'll be playing games that have both first and third person. In this, I'm trying to like fit into a town and stuff, so I may as well play me. I'm not like traveling to this town, destroying everybody by accident, moving on to the next town. 
I just want Lod to be my friend again. This game does have multiplayer. Yes, is it crossplay? Because the reason I'm asking is because I am creating Four Corners Farm. So Four Corners Farm has four separate farm plots. So I can get online and I can build a cabin and I can play if it's got crossplay. I spelled it wrong. Is that intentional? You look at a word long enough, and you don't think you can spell it anymore. Well, either way, I'm going to do Four Corners Farm. Fallen. Final Fantasy protagonist lost in a farm. Prologue game, go. No crossplay, sad. I do recommend playing it, though. Definitely, definitely. I do highly recommend playing it. We have controllers that'll be coming. I'm not buying another new controller right now. I want to. I desperately want to get a separate controller. And I nearly did with that special Wi-Fi connector. When I was going to get a Wi-Fi connector, there was a bundle with the new Xbox Series X controller. But they're like, nah, can't have them. It's like, fuck. I'd ordered it and everything and they cancelled it. I'm like, well, fuck you then. So I found a way around it. And now... I could have named myself Grandpa. Nah. Oh yeah, I'm assuming that people have either played Stardew Valley or really aren't here for the ins and outs of Grandpa's letter to me. Because there's not a ton of story to it. We are playing this time. We are a... Or at least we're going to start out as believing that we are a lost Final Fantasy protagonist. Because our parents named us protagonist. So clearly we're from bigger things. You would have been happier if I'd chosen Saddle? No. Oh, even better if I had chosen. Okay, yep. Care more. Look, I'm sorry. I'm fucking... I'm already like... Oh, that's me. Pressing A on a letter that I didn't... Like, I have a cursor and it's like, oh. Dear protagonist. I thought your parents named you something really stupid when you were younger. But, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of change. Something happened to me. Long ago. Or oh, the same thing happened to me long ago. Yeah, we'll expect that to happen a fair bit. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Fonts. Real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. And I built a shitty little cabin and nothing else. I did nothing with that farm. I just lived on a fucking... In the forest. I was basically best friends with the homeless dude. Fucking... My, sorry, page two. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy. Your A farm. It's located in Stardew Valley. Make sure you don't pronounce that incorrectly because it's got uh, umlauts on top of the O. It's, it's A farm. Your A farm. Whose farm? It's A farm. Your A farm. Hey. Hey. It's located in Stardew Valley, on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honour the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love. Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? He still owes me money. 
Lewis like checks the mail as it's going out of the village. He's like, leave that last page out of it. I don't owe him shit. Yeah, yeah, no, send it out. Say, make sure that the, when the kid comes in, they say good day to me. Yeah, no, some fucking hippie parents were like, oh, they're a hero, just because we've got slimes and skeletons everywhere. Yeah, no, they should be here today. Pam's picking them up on the bus. All right. All right, well, I've got to go meet them. Anyway, see ya. Click. Oh, I'm not doing voices for everybody. Hello, you must be the protagonist. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to grow your new home. What? To fetch you? And show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. He was just on a call. The farm's right over there, if you'll follow me. I am keen. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Yeah, righto. And here we are, your new home. Ah, the new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, Mayor of Pelican Town. How's it going? You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So, you're moving to your grandfather's old cottage? Yeah, no, I had the documents printed up for me, yep. It's a good house, very rustic. It's a little, it's, it's a nice little house. It's very tiny. It's one room. It's a one room house. Plenty of room for logs. Rustic, that's the way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt though. Rude. Don't listen to her, protagonist. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Hmm. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. You can sleep in that little one-room shack that hasn't been dusted since your granddad died. We haven't even been there to touch it. He could have bodies hidden behind that door. We've never checked. Well, I just came out of there, but that's only because I was looking for the leftover cookies that he owed me. Anyway, this is getting weird, so I'll let you go to bed. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town and a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Yeah, righto, dickhead. The fuck did you call me? Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by for it during the night to collect it. Oh, creepy like. I'll wait till you sleep. I don't care how late. I'll be here. Anyway. <laughs> Good luck. Ah, uh, I can't keep a straight face. Welcome new people to the village. I always like to make him think the worst first. He'll come round. Little cunt. <laughs> A true reimagining of Stardew Valley. Five stars. Oh, I'm working. I'm working towards it. I'll, I'll earn those five stars. Parsnip seeds and a new journal entry. You received fifteen parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Oh, here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Alright, I will be the most awesome! Weather report. Weather forecast for tomorrow is going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Fortune teller. They're in good humour today. We'll have extra luck. Living off the land. Greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forage. Earn some cash for working on your first harvest. Yeah, alright. Alright mate, alright. 
careful. So what do we got? We got shitty tools. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh, I hate the range of these. It's so bad. Alright, sorry. It's just, it's not, I haven't played Sardew in quite a long time, and I had a character. Once upon a time on a farm that I was very proud of. I might show you one day. I'm not ready for that today. Uh, it's, it's, it's blasphemy chopping up grass like that until I've got a silo. I gotta get a silo before the season changes so that I can harvest all this grass, get rid of it. All oh, the bushes at least, anyway, not the grass. We want the grass to spread. Got a pickaxe. All we need to do is plant these parsnips first though, yeah? Plant the parsnips. Let's keep on track. Ah, nope. Yeah. Okay. We need the hoe. How many have we got? 15. I need 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Boom. What's next? I need more. Fuck. Uh, let's go three more then this way. And then these ones can be for the extra seeds that I pick up. Because I know I get them. They're special looking bushes. They give you a boost at the start of the season because they give you random shit. What do they look like? I don't remember what they look like because they look different every season. Get them away. What's, what is the term? The famous term. Out of my way, rocks. Yeah? Can't go anywhere. There's no special bushes though. I'm not seeing any. different? I can't see anything that look different. Nothing. There's nothing. There's nothing different. There's no special... <sighs> Why? No, no special little bushes. Oh, we have the cave. The cave's in the middle here. This will be nice when we build it. <laughs> well, I'm glad you got a kick out of it, spider. How you doing, buddy? Good to see you back. Celebration last week. He's a big deal now. Hey, hey, you watch it back there. You watch it, Hashira. Only, only blood relative jokes are appropriate. 
<laughs> Do you, um... Surprise, we're even still talking to you. Money and fame will get to me soon. Oh, mate. Mate, come on. That that blew me away. You know, I was famous long before I even started the Emporium. So really, you know, you, you knew me at my peak. Somehow you're still here, so I think the canary in the coal mine. I think I've gone too far away from my house. Well, there's a dog bowl. Actually, one of these has a quarry at the bottom of it, I think. I want to make a path to that. I'm just going to stick to the side. Just ratted you out, the secret. Alright, I got a bit of this shit. Give. Give, copper. We will be the best fighting hero of the time. Because that's why our parents named us protagonist. Because that is our job to be the protagonist. And I will be the most protagonist y protagonist ever. Ow, 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 ow. Knees, ow, knees. What are you doing? Ow, ow, ow. Just a second, slight technical difficulties. Okay, we are back. It was actually a little bit colder tonight than what it has been. With a... I had to get the blanket sorted to make sure I was warm enough. What's the temperature where everybody is? How hot or, and or cold are you? I think I want to clear out this space around the house. I just feel like the first thing I'm going to want to do is put up silos and shit. I'm gonna clear up all this area up here. Or I can build stuff. Ah, the final drink delivery of the night. Delightful. 27 degrees Celsius. It's pretty warm. It's all right though. So 27 is not bad. 7 degrees Celsius apparently. You don't base it off that though. It's a hot or cold. Yeah. Because you acclimatize, right? So 10 degrees for somebody whose max is usually like 30 on a fucking stupid hot day. 10 degrees is like, oh, it's a bit, it's a bit chilly. But if your normal, like your peak during summer, your one massive day is like 40, 10's cold. 10's cold as fuck. Nice, but it's cold as fuck. You're spelling in on point today? Oh, you're in good company, bud. That's why we have your A farm. It's your A farm.
Gotta keep an eye on the clock too. It's gonna get late enough that we're gonna get uh, get too tired to keep working the next day. Can't stay up too late. Sleep is important, everybody. Sleep is very important. It is number one. You need to make sure you get enough sleep. Uh-huh. You certainly do. I started up here trying to clear this area and ended up fucking way down there. Sorry, Grass. You're not going to be here anyway. Did anyone join the party? Mate, I still use that now. I still use that now. Yeah, and you just had a sip of his coke, so you'll be awake forever. Motherfucker. Free single malts, best party, nice. We forgot to water our crops. We forgot to water them. But that's okay. What's on TV? Weather report. It's gonna rain all day tomorrow. Fortune teller. A new viewer has joined us. A young man from Stardew Valley. Welcome, welcome. The spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Cool. So what I like to do on day two, uh, after these fucking conversations. Oh, uh, hi there, good morning. Hi, Glenn. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore, that's good. Yeah, thanks, Glenn. If you want to get the most out of the ores you find, you'll need a furnace. Thank you, Glenn. Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Thank you, Clint. Much appreciated. You learned how to craft furnace. Thanks. Thank you, Clint. Furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. Right, okay, cool. Thank you, Clint. Actually, I did not get an invite. Must have gotten lost in the mail. Single malts at home, though. As they're in spirit. Exactly. Oh, Clint, you're still here. You go. When you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me update one of your tools. I can make your work a lot easier. Thank you, Clint. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. Thank you, Glenn. Now, I need to fucking hook it. Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie. I don't know Willie's voice yet. We'll figure that out later. That's just me reading it. No voice yet, ladies and gentlemen. I hate the shitty starter fucking watering can because you over water. I got five of these things. Fuck, yeah, alright. I don't think I get that many that quick. I'm saving every little bit that I can today. Oh, such a lovely wee farm. Yeah, exactly. It's a little baby farm. Little baby farm. I've only got one bar. I need to dump shit. 
Uh, I don't have storage. I have no storage. Uh, introductions, forging ahead, craft a furnace to the beach, be to the beach. No, I don't want to do any of those things. How to build. How to make book. Box. Box. Me and build you, box. 50 wood. Oh my fucking god. I just want to go to the fucking mine and go and see Clint before it gets too fucking late so that he can... I just... I just want a better... I just want a better watering can. I hate watering... I hate watering things. We farm. <laughs> not, a, not a farm. Not a, not a farm for weed. No, no, no. Forty-eight. Fuck you. Fuck you, Wood. Fuck you. Oh no, no, no! That's just the lemon tree. Yeah. Okay. Surely we have done enough. Yes. Buttons. Come on. I am gonna put you anywhere. Oh, fucking right next to me. Yeah, okay. Cock. Oh, yeah, no, not there, though. Make it. Yeah. I've got two of them. I'm going to put the other one right there. Yeah, perfect. Good. Quick, mine. Let's go. He closes at four. We're just going to go in. We're going to fucking cause a ruckus. And we're going to get the fuck out. What's this game about? Never really cared to watch it. Is there an end game or is it chill like Animal Crossing? Uh, a little bit of both. There's definitely stuff to do. There is a quest as such. Never see Animal Crossing. You guess it's casual though. You'd be surprised. These games are really fucking intense. They're just intense with like menus and shit. Hey, how you doing? You look like a wise old man. Stranger, hello. Hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. Oh. Lovely. Can't. Alright. Fine. Can't do anything about that. So I guess we will go into town. Somehow? Is there a way down from here somewhere? All the way over here. Bleh. Hey, I know you. Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. Yeah, thanks. Pierre's General Store. Closed on Wednesdays. Then it'll be open today. Hey, buddy. I have a new plan. I need to get... Holy fuck. So much shit I need to get. I need to get... Four days... 10 days where they keep producing after that, so that'll, that'll give me twice. That'll still give me two. 12 days to produce one large cauliflower. Potato seeds. Plant these in the spring. They have a chance of yielding multiple potatoes at harvest. Well, I need at least one of everything. I've already got parsnips. So I need a bean starter. You're a cauliflower. You watch it. Cauliflower. Potato. No space in my inventory. No space in my inventory. Sick. Alright. All this today has been going great. That's what we built the chests for. What time is it? 11.20. Good. we got plenty of time. Get out of my way! Ah, yeah. Big question mark. Oh, crazy. Hey. Woo -hoo. It's a calendar. Come on, my parents have been training me to be a protagonist all my life. This is what you give me? A calendar with everyone's birthdays on it? I'm supposed to slay this planet's next mighty menace. Ooh, bugs. Whatever it is, I won't be able to pick it up. Fuck! I knew that was going to happen. I knew it before I fucking did anything. I need to move my overlay badly. Um, I'll be back for you.
so... We're gonna fucking slam these over. We're gonna plant these two. So that we don't forget. Put the trellis there. Just be a dick. Cauliflower there. Water both. Get the fuck out of here. Thank you, treasure of the deep. Prehistoric vertebra. Sick. Thanks, bud. You found an artifact. The curator of the local museum might want to know about this. Yeah, alright. Sounds good. Wait, do you guys have a museum in here? Something? Anything? Piers? Piers? Oh, fucking every kind of always in my way. Hey, bud. I do all my grocery shopping here. Yeah, you, know, you don't really have a choice, do you? We've got a bean starter, we got cauliflower seeds. We want potato seeds. We want... Can't afford anything else. A couple more bean starters then. And a couple of potato seeds. Decisions, decisions there. It's pretty early. We should get there with plenty of time. Wait, what do you charge? How much is it? Great tools. 2,000 gold and 5 copper bars. Yeah, it's not happening today. Shop. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Howdy. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. What's wrong, buddy? You alright? You're good? An intruder. What's this? You found something. Let me see it. Alright, mate. It's like an old bone. Probably out of like a T bone steak. Dog was chewing on it, something like that. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Well, okay, it's a bone. Hmm. I got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery to de together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. As a kindness. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Everyone forgets about this guy, Albatross. He's a very forgettable fella. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama said... No, he's not also that voice. <laughs> Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Why do you still have that accent? Stop, wait, I need to talk to each of you. Hi. Oh, hello, I'm Penny. Tips on farming. Use fertilizer to improve quality, reduce workload, or hasten crop growth. Fruit trees take a whole season to grow, but they require very little maintenance. 
Keep the area directly around your new sapling clear, or else it may not grow properly. Crops will die as soon as the season ends, unless they grow in multiple seasons, for example corn. Some crops, such as kale and wheat, need to be harvested with a scythe. Like your death, and they are there to meet the reaper that day. Whoa, that got really dark. Who wrote those, uh... Who wrote that? That's fucked up. We're gonna get down to the beachfront before 5 o'clock. Hello, stranger person. Hi, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Cool. Thanks, bud. Nice dock. It says you've got a nice dock. Oh, hey there, son. Didn't hear you there. I heard there was a newcomer in town, though. Good to finally meet you. Hi. How you doing? Your jetty, your, your pier here. It's, um, it's decent. I like it. It's a nice jetty. Uh, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas myself. Getting my land legs back. It was a big haul. Sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Fishing rod, that is. Here, I want you to have my old rod. Please, see if it fits your grasp. Touch my rod. My old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And maybe, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. No, I didn't say it. There's no proof. You received a bamboo pole from me just now. There's good weather here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so if you come by, if you need supplies, we'll also buy anything you catch. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the point. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> that's what my old pappy used to say, anyway. Thanks, Billy. It's been fun for a couple of minutes, but now I'm bored of you. Is the shop still open? Ouch, man. <laughs> ah, expensive. All right, then. He's got a ladder. What's he got a ladder to? This leads up to a sleeping cubby. It's off limits. Nah. Not even. Not even off limits. Ooh, ocean stuff. This stuff sells well. I need like 10,000 or some shit. With 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. Okay, cool. No, I can fix that one. 300 wood. But we need wood for the silo. But we need money for the silo as well. Mm. All the good stuff's on the other side. Hello. Ah, the new farmer. We've all been expecting you. And whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. He's weird. Because I said... I don't think I can get anything for 10 gold. I'm gonna try. Hello. Oh. 10 gold is nothing in this town. 
Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. I'll remember to. Hey. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. Oh, hey, you're the new guy. Huh, cool. Oh, yeah, cool. Cool, bud. We have more seeds. We, don't want, we, we definitely want to plant more seeds tonight. Oh, new person. Oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Sure. That's how you want to look at me picking over the remains of my grandfather's estate? Then yes, I'm the new farmer boy. Rude. Why didn't it give this to him? Nah, fuck it, I'm selling it. Get out of here. It's probably going to be important. Damn it. It's probably not. Just throw it in the bin. Do it now. <laughs> Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, six. We're gonna go one here, one here. We have one cauliflower here. And we have three potatoes. Now I'm going to chop down this tree, because it's in my way, I hate it. Did I remember I can raid bins? Yes, I did. There's nothing in them, because I did them the very first thing in the morning. They're empty. Stuff out. I don't want to take stuff out. I'll put stuff in. Sell some of them. I mean, I've got a little bit of energy left. Let's keep chopping down some stuff. See how long it'll take us to get the 300 wood. Probably run out of energy long before that happens. I don't like that big tree stump there. That's it, that's all she wrote. 53. Lost the 17 I already had in there. Alright. Bedtime. Sleep for the night. Plus one axe proficiency. Tree sometimes drop seeds. New crafting recipe. Wild seeds. New crafting recipe. Field snack. Nice. Ooh, that was 50 each. Not bad, not bad. Forecast for tomorrow is it's going to be clear and sunny all day. Fortune teller says the spirits are annoyed today, so you should go fuck yourself if you go outside. Ah, uh, yep. I don't have to water anything. I keep finding cool stuff. My backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Packin' packin'? Wanton. I'm not going to need the watering can, because I'm not watering anything, right? So I'm going to leave the watering can here. Oh, I can't access them from there. Well, that's dumb. 
Let's fill this up before we get annoyed. And keep the fishing rod for now too. finished clearing this yet. Still working on it, hey? Okay then. Um, I don't think I can get to the quarry. I can get out to like this little bit here. Yep. Bugger. I'll stay in my granite house until the end of the week. Grow a little bit of food, commune with nature, whatever else you wanted me to do. And at the end of the week, once I can get into that mine and see if there's treasure there, because I need to be a protagonist, I need to find an adventure. The biggest adventure I've had is inheriting an old cabin. You got TV though. I look so emo. Yeah, because I've, I'm I'm a Final Fantasy protagonist, as, as, as I am named as such. I'm from Final Fantasy. I'm, I'm sure I am. My parents said I would be. Dead end, okay. You know what Stardew Valley needs? Stardew Valley needs a Pokemon sized world where you go out and like collect seeds and shit. As you throw it, play through a Pokemon sized world, but in Stardew Valley, you go out and instead of seasons, you have regions. work more seasons in, you can create new seasons by being different regions. You don't just have to have four regions. You would have the four seasons as your base ones, then have a fifth one that's like, I don't know, lava cabin or whatever. Make it an action-y game. Why the music turned down or what? Is that an option? No, the music's up, it's just quiet. You can't wait till you gotta go fishing. And do all that part. Yeah. That'll come. Early beginnings, yeah? You know, great things come out of very simple beginnings. Oh, I'm gonna start clearing this area then.
making our way down to the quarry. Clear off enough of the yard. Have a nice path coming down here. Just enjoying those rain sounds. toxic one or is it the other one? I'm gonna try it. Yeah, that was plus energy. It was the big one, is the bad one. Still got a bit of energy left. It's only 4 pm. Alright, well, we'll keep clearing for today then. Tomorrow it'll be sunny. But I'm hoping that they've cleared that rock up there by then. That's all she wrote for today. I'm gonna be able to carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. Check if anything's on TV. So. I hope everyone has had an awesome time. I hope you have had a great day. And I hope you have a better tomorrow. This has been our first delve into Stardew Valley. We are going to go for more in the future. Thanks for coming by. I'll see you again. Okay, now, so, spoilers. I did that so that I can cut off my YouTube video. Because I'm going to be able to edit off the end of it.
you were like, what the fuck? Yeah. Because I can end it there. Now, I am going to end Stardew Valley, but I am going to keep streaming. So instead of me being like, oh yeah, I'm just going to change games. I did that so that I can just basically trim all this end bit off where I'm just walking around. It's the same day. Nothing saved. Whatever, whatever. And then when I come back to Stardew Valley, it'll be the next morning. But now I'm going to play something else. I feel like going back and playing a bit more... Destiny, I suppose. I think I'm going to play some Destiny. I'm going to work on a... Let's put it out there. Let's put it out there to all 800 of you that are watching right now. Should I do... What's, well, okay, well, what's, what sort of, what sort of, it, it's going to be a, a PvP or PvE build of any class. So you can do PvP, PvE, or any, uh, for any class. Hunter, Warlock, Titan, either PvP or PvE. And I'll make a build in Destiny for it. That should be a unicorn. That's helpful. Hashira, if you're still there, if anybody else is still there that plays Destiny... I feel like making a cool build, but I don't know what to make. I've got a few options in front of me, but I don't know. I need. I, I feel like I need that sort of spark of inspiration. Uh, didn't work. Well, I'm going to change games now. So the stream will stop, but it will start again. So hang around. 